punt. My gosh, it's into the stands. There's a snap hook. The side judge never saw it. I've never seen one. I've seen Shanks. Look out left. The rush made him do it. It's a 10-yard punt. This was a moment ago, Sean Powell in his second week here oh. as the Bengals punter. Look at the football turning as he dropped it. The ball turned. Boy, he hit the outside of it. That's Darren Simmons, the special teams coach. They've been good here this afternoon. See if you can't pin Dallas deep and make them go the distance against this group. A shank. This punt goes nowhere off the foot of Martin. And let's see where they mark it. A complete miss hit. And they're going to mark it at the 41. Giants buffoonery struck again in the 1985 NFC Championship when punter Sean Landetta took an astounding swing and a miss against the Bears. Landetta from his end zone. Bears will get good field position. Oh, he missed this! This is the football! He missed this! It's it's the All right! It's Sean Gale! Holy smokes! Low snap. Here's Crowder, and he takes it out to the 30. I gotta go back. Did he just miss that, or was that blocked? That was bizarre. That slipped through his finger. Yeah. Only a 17-yard punt. For Denver, and he fails to make the play. And then a shank off the foot of Rocca. And the Broncos are going to get the football at the Washington 35-yard line. And Sav Rocca has been so good punting the ball today, and he picked a bad time to shank one. Well, just a little bit. You can see his speed is off. Well, Wink with a shank. Late fourth quarter in Philadelphia last week. Another one here. These are just killers. We talk about field position. Man, 15-yard punt. Colquitt got knocked around on that last punt that he had. This is Zane Gonzalez punting for Cleveland. The kicker is out to punt as Colquitt appears to be injured. Better have his hands warmed up to catch it. And this is no good, as you would expect. Bounces out of bounds at the 45-yard line. So Zane Gonzalez put in a tough spot. Not a good one for Zane. It goes down as a 16-yard punt. Wind in this third quarter because he did have the momentum at the end of the half. He did think about it. Newsom under the goal post. Got to be careful not to step out of the end zone. The side of his foot bounces out of bounds. The Giants will take over at the 22. And this is not a good punt. This is a terrible punt by the rookie. It goes out of bounds at the 32 31 yard line. Quigley is standing deep in his own end zone. Shanks it. Now when the Jets needed a, a good punt from Quigley, they got an absolutely horrible punt. Rams waits at the Cleveland 45. And a shank. This one might be out of bounds at the 8-yard line. Did he shank it or was this blocked? No, no, he just flat shanked it. He almost missed it. He was so conscious of what was coming up in front of him that he took his eye off the ball. He took his eye off the ball earlier today when he shanked the punt. Here it comes. See, he sees the rush coming. He really does. A seven-yard kick for Frost. Looked like one of but, mine. You know, I, again, I did it for 11 years, and I'm telling you, when you're sitting in the end zone, the only thing that you have in your mind is I've got to get this thing off, and I've got to get it as fast as I can. But the most important thing i got to do is keep my eye on the ball. And he didn't do that. 
He picked his head up for the second time. You know, it's one thing getting great field position after a punt, but this is ridiculous.